Pollution from transport has been a major contributor to poor air quality in European cities for many years. And it has a serious impact on people's health. It's a problem which affects every one of us. Urban traffic is responsible for 40% of the CO2 emissions generated by road transport. European Mobility Week, now in its seventh year, is an annual attempt to raise awareness of the issue. This year's theme is Clean Air for All. The event is now marked around the world. Through concrete measures implemented every year, it encourages a shift towards sustainable urban transport. The growing number of participants shows that local authorities play a crucial role in helping citizens move around their towns quickly, safely, and without polluting the air they breathe. First, let's go to Germany. Frankfurt is particularly active on the mobility front. The city center is pedestrianized, and bicycles have gradually become the best means of getting around. This is a very definite philosophy, backed up by a strategy involving a wide variety of initiatives. Bike taxis have appeared on the scene for getting around the city center, a private initiative, but in full consultation with Frankfurt's mobility managers. To promote maximum use of public transport in the city, mobility managers have just introduced the customer guarantee. If a bus, tram or metro is delayed by more than 10 minutes, your ticket is refunded. Our goal is to have satisfied users and to show that we're trying to become better, more punctual and more at the service of our clients. The Italian city of Bologna has large numbers of tourists, which makes the issue of mobility all the more complex. The city of Bologna was one of the first in Italy to develop fairly advanced mobility plans. It introduced the first pedestrianized and limited traffic zones. In recent years, the city has introduced a new urban mobility strategy with permanent measures to promote more environmentally friendly transport, such as electric bicycles and car sharing. The package of measures includes a network of CCTV cameras and the upgrading of certain roads for the benefit of pedestrians, cyclists and public transport. To achieve its aims and learning from previous experiences, the traffic control center in the police building plays an important role. Two computerized systems complete the arsenal to enforce the mobility plan. We have 195 cameras. They cover the heaviest and most sensitive traffic points in the city. With this mobility plan, the city of Bologna looks set to achieve ambitious targets for 2010, to reduce the use of cars by 14% and increase the use of bicycles by 31%. And continued participation in the European Mobility Week is part of that strategy.